Hello, ladies. Today we're diving into the topic that affects millions of women worldwide, but often gets whispered about in hushed tones: menopause. But hold on tight, because we're here to debunk the myths, unravel the mysteries, and shine a spotlight on the truth behind this natural phase of life. Get ready to explore the essentials. We're diving into when menopause hits, decoding the telltale signs and symptoms, and then taking a deeper inspection into the nitty-gritty of menopause, including what to look for in case of complications and so on. But hold on to your hats because we're not stopping there. We will, of course, end on a positive note by looking at how we can effectively manage menopausal symptoms naturally. So, when does menopause hit? Now that we've got a handle on when menopause typically makes its grand entrance, let's buckle up for the journey through its various stages, from perimenopause's unpredictable twists and turns to the climactic finale of postmenopause. Each stage brings its own set of joys and challenges. Let's start with the first stage of menopause, called perimenopause, from the root word peri, meaning around. This stage literally translates to the time around menopause. It can last anywhere from a few months to several years, and is characterized by fluctuating hormone levels, resulting in irregular periods, mood swings, hot flashes, and other symptoms. To give a number on when perimenopause starts, it can begin anywhere from two to eight years before menopause. Yes, still vague, right? And that's because every woman's body is unique, and many experience menopause differently. Just as every individual has a unique fingerprint, so too is the experience of perimenopause distinct for each woman. This personal variation means that there's no one-size-fits-all description for how or when menopause will manifest. Moving on to the next stage, let's talk about menopause. It's a natural process that happens when a woman's menstrual cycles come to an end. Officially, it's considered menopause when a woman goes 12 months without their period. Typically, menopause occurs between the ages of 45 and 55, with the average age being around 51. So, after menopause, the last stage called postmenopause follows. It goes on until the end of a woman's life, and by this time, most menopause symptoms will calm down and hormones will even out. However, it is important to note that postmenopause does not equal the end of all hormonal changes. Hormone levels can still fluctuate and cause symptoms like hot flashes or mood swings, although they may be less intense compared to perimenopause. Next up, let's talk about the common signs of menopause. The most common symptoms of menopause are largely due to fluctuations in two key hormones, estrogen and progesterone. These hormonal changes can lead to a variety of symptoms that can be grouped based on the hormone most responsible. Let's start with estrogen-related symptoms. First up is hot flashes and night sweats, sudden waves of heat that can sweep over the body, causing sweating and discomfort. With lower levels of estrogen, women can also experience vaginal dryness. Decreases in estrogen result in less moisture, elasticity, and thickness in the vaginal wall. This can lead to painful intercourse or general discomfort, leading to dryness and discomfort, especially during sexual activity. Another common symptom is urinary incontinence, which can occur due to a weakened pelvic floor muscle as estrogen levels decline. This may result in sudden urges to urinate or leaking urine when coughing, sneezing, or laughing. Some women may also experience mood swings as a result of lower estrogen levels. These can manifest as irritability, anxiety, or depression. This is because estrogen influences neurotransmitter pathways in the brain, including serotonin, which affects mood. Fluctuations in estrogen levels can therefore lead to mood swings and irritability. Now let's discuss the progesterone-related symptoms. As estrogen levels decline, progesterone levels also tend to decrease. Lower levels of progesterone can lead to irregular or absent periods. Another symptom of lower progesterone is insomnia. This hormone plays a role in regulating your sleep patterns. So when levels decrease, women may experience difficulty falling or staying asleep. This can lead to fatigue and other issues. Lower levels of progesterone can also contribute to weight gain. As this hormone helps regulate metabolism and fat storage, as a result, women may find it more difficult to maintain their weight or lose weight as they age. Lastly, lower levels of progesterone may also cause breast tenderness, as this hormone is involved in the development and maintenance of breast tissue. 
Some women may also experience swelling or discomfort in their breast. Those are just some of the most common symptoms. Have you experienced one of them? Please share them in the comment section below. The next question is, how long do symptoms last, huh? Well, the duration of these symptoms can vary from person to person. Some women may only experience them for a few months, while others may have them for years. It all depends on individual factors such as overall health and lifestyle habits. It's also important to note that these symptoms can overlap and occur at different times during perimenopause and menopause. Some women may experience them all at once, while others may only have a few. But the good news is that these symptoms are usually temporary and will eventually subside as the body adjusts to the new hormone levels. So now that we've talked a bit about the duration and variability of menopausal symptoms, let's delve deeper into what's stirring the cauldron of change within our bodies. Understanding the underlying causes of menopause is like peeling back the layers of a captivating mystery. For most women, menopause is a natural part of aging, but hey, some medical procedures and therapies can kick it in early. Let's talk about medical procedures first. When it comes to menopause, certain medical procedures and treatments can expedite its arrival or even catch us off guard. Certain surgical procedures such as hysterectomy or oophorectomy, removal of the ovaries, can induce menopause. This is because these procedures remove the organs responsible for producing hormones essential to the menstrual cycle and fertility. So when they take out one or both ovaries, oophorectomy, menopause hits right away. Ovaries are the estrogen and progesterone VIPs. Now hysterectomy, removing the womb, can trigger menopause too, especially if they swipe both of your ovaries. Chemotherapy and radiation for cancer? Yep, they can bring on early menopause by messing with hormone production. Dealing with premature menopause? It sure does. This is when menopause happens before the age of 40, and it can be triggered by a variety of factors, such as autoimmune disorders, genetic conditions, or even smoking. How are you ladies feeling? Hang in there. And sit tight as we get ready to explore even more about this transformative phase in a woman's life. Now let's shine a spotlight on the potential complications that can accompany anyone's menopausal journey. Menopause is known to come with its fair share of symptoms, but some women may experience complications that require medical attention. One common complication is osteoporosis, a condition where the bones become weaker and more susceptible to fractures. This occurs because estrogen helps maintain bone density. It does this by preventing the breakdown of old bone and promoting the production of new bone. So when estrogen levels decrease during menopause, bones can become weaker and more prone to fractures. And as estrogen levels decline during menopause, bone loss increases. Another potential complication is an increased risk of cardiovascular disease. Estrogen plays a role in maintaining healthy blood vessels by promoting their elasticity and contributing to proper blood flow regulation. So as estrogen levels decrease during menopause, the risk of heart disease and stroke may increase. Mental health can also be impacted during menopause, with some women experiencing mood changes, anxiety, or depression. It's important to seek support and treatment if these symptoms become overwhelming. And naturally, weight gain is a frequently mentioned concern among women going through menopause. The hormonal shifts during this period can impact metabolism, meaning that it may be easier to gain weight and harder to lose it. As to why, the quick answer is that the hormones that fluctuate during menopause also affect hormones. You see, during menopause, it's not just one hormone having a wild party. It's a whole hormonal orchestra playing a tune that affects every corner of your body. But hey, if you're itching to dive into the scientific tidbits, check out our other videos on this channel where we unpacked all the fascinating science stuff that makes menopause the intriguing phenomenon it is. Trust us, you won't want to miss it. Let's not forget urinary tract infection, or UTI, as it's commonly referred to. Menopause can increase the risk of developing a UTI due to changes in vaginal pH and the urinary tract becoming more vulnerable to bacteria. How? As estrogen levels decline, the walls of the vagina become thinner and drier making it easier for bacteria to enter and cause an infection. But don't let these potential complications scare you, ladies. By staying proactive with your health, you can navigate through menopause while minimizing any possible complications. 
So to take care of yourself during this time, and here are 11 ways to manage your menopausal symptoms naturally. First on our list is to eat lots of fruits and veggies. You've been told this plenty of times. We know, but trust us, it's worth repeating. These nutrient-rich foods are packed with essential vitamins, minerals, and antioxidants that play a crucial role in supporting optimal health. By incorporating a variety of fruits and veggies into your diet, you can help regulate hormone levels, boost immunity, and promote overall well-being. Remember, the vibrant colors of these natural foods signify the diverse array of nutrients they offer, making them a vital component of a balanced and nutritious diet. Next is to stay active and prioritize exercise as a consistent part of your routine. Engaging in regular physical activity not only aids in hormone regulation and weight management, but also plays a significant role in enhancing mood and boosting energy levels. Remember, it's not necessary to engage in high-intensity workouts. Even activities like a brisk walk or gentle yoga practice can have a positive impact on your overall well-being. Another important tip is to stay hydrated. As we mentioned earlier, hormonal changes during menopause can lead to dryness and thinning of the vaginal walls. Drinking plenty of water helps keep the body hydrated and can improve vaginal moisture. And when it comes to staying hydrated, it's important to remember the significance of eating regular balanced meals and avoiding skipping them. Skipping meals can disrupt blood sugar levels, potentially exacerbating menopausal symptoms such as hot flashes and mood swings. Ensuring a consistent and nutritious meal schedule can play a key role in managing these symptoms effectively. In addition to maintaining a healthy diet and exercise routine, managing stress is key during menopause. Look into mindfulness-based stress relief activities like meditation. Stress can exacerbate symptoms like hot flashes and irritability. Finding ways to relax and de-stress, such as meditation or deep breathing exercises, can help alleviate these symptoms. Another helpful tip for managing menopausal symptoms is to avoid trigger foods that can exacerbate issues like hot flashes and night sweats. These include steering clear of caffeine, alcohol, spicy foods, and unhealthy fats. Instead, consider incorporating soothing alternatives into your diet, such as herbal teas known for their calming effects and opting for healthy fats sourced from nutrient-rich foods like avocados and nuts. Additionally, it is beneficial to consume more phytoestrogens, which are plant-based compounds known for their similarity in structure to estrogen. This resemblance may aid in alleviating menopausal symptoms such as hot flashes and mood swings. Excellent sources of phytoestrogens include soy products like tofu, tempa, and soy milk, as well as flax seeds, lentils, chickpeas, and other legumes. Incorporating these foods into your diet can potentially provide relief and support during menopause. It's also important to avoid late-night snacking, as this can disrupt sleep and worsen your menopausal symptoms, like night sweats. So steer clear of late-night munching, even if it is very tempting to do so. To keep things in check, try to stick to a regular eating schedule and finish your last meal at least two hours before hitting the hay. This simple habit can lead to better sleep and ease any menopause-related discomfort. Don't skimp on protein. Including lean protein sources in your diet is crucial for maintaining muscle mass and keeping your energy levels stable throughout the day. Opting for nutrient-rich choices such as fish, chicken, tofu, and beans not only provides essential proteins but also offers a variety of vitamins and minerals that are beneficial for overall health and well-being. By incorporating these options into your meals, you can support your body's needs and promote a balanced and nutritious diet. Next, it's beneficial to avoid consuming refined sugar and carbohydrates, as they can lead to fluctuations in blood sugar levels. These fluctuations can result in feelings of fatigue and moodiness, and of course, exacerbate other menopausal symptoms. Opting for whole grains, fresh fruits, and a variety of vegetables is a much better choice. These nutrient-rich options will help sustain your energy levels steadily without the negative effects associated with refined sugar. Finally, seek out natural supplements that can support hormone balance during menopause. Some examples include those that help relieve menopausal symptoms, support bone health, and promote overall well-being during this transitional phase. 
For example, try using O30HS, short for Over 30 Hormone Support, by Gleeful Supplements. These are natural supplements that can provide relief from hot flashes, mood swings, and other symptoms caused by hormonal imbalances. Over 30 Hormone Support is like your natural hormone hero. It's an easy-to-swallow capsule packed with a precise blend of ancient herbs in the golden ratio, such as dong quai, maca root, ginger, tribulus terrestris, and ashwagandha. These herbs, trusted for centuries, help women over 30 keep their hormones balanced without any caffeine, fillers, or synthetic stuff. And if you have more stubborn symptoms in the mix, you can also level up your arsenal and check out this amazing find by the Gleeful Supplements team of scientists and researchers. The Over 30 Hormone Support Plus, a breakthrough formula that acts as a booster of over 30 hormone support. Over 30 Hormone Support Plus is like a little natural powerhouse. It's got all these ancient hormone balancing herbs. Black Cohosh, Evening Primrose Oil, St. John's Wort, and Dong Kai, just packed into an easy-to-swallow capsule. These herbs known for centuries are there to help women over 30 keep their hormone balance in check. And the best part? No caffeine, fillers, or synthetic stuff in there. Just pure goodness. And last but not least, Total Joint 360, also by Gleeful Supplements, is a must-try for women going through menopause. This supplement contains an all-natural MSM, glucosamine, and curcumin, the active ingredient in turmeric, three essential ingredients that have been clinically proven to support joint health and mobility. These nutrients work together to reduce inflammation, improve joint function, and alleviate pain associated with menopause-related joint issues. Phew! We've covered a lot of ground today, ladies, and we've only just scratched the surface of this transformative journey through menopause. But fear not, because armed with knowledge and a dash of natural remedies, we're equipped to tackle any twists and turns that come our way. As we've explored, menopause isn't just about hot flashes and mood swings. It's a multifaceted experience that can bring its fair share of complications. From osteoporosis to cardiovascular risks, we've shed light on the potential challenges that may arise during this phase of life. But amidst the complexities, there's hope and empowerment. By embracing natural solutions like healthy eating, regular exercise, and the power of supplements like Over 30 Hormone Support, Over 30 Hormone Support Plus, and Total Joint 360, we can alleviate symptoms and embark on a journey of vibrant health and well-being. So let's take charge of our health, ladies. Join the Gleeful community on Facebook to connect with others on a similar journey and discover even more insights and tips for navigating menopause with grace and vitality. And hey, if you're ready to take the next step towards holistic wellness, Check out the product links in the description below to learn more about how Gleeful Supplements can support you on your menopausal journey. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button, give this video a thumbs up, and share it with your friends and loved ones who could use a dose of empowerment and knowledge about menopause. Now over to you. What topics would you like us to dive into next? Share your thoughts and ideas in the comments below. Until next time, Stay gleeful and empowered.